Hello again, it's Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. My camera is hot. It's a hot day in Florida and this is an 8 by 10 inch canvas. And I have some beautiful edge catcher paint and I have a very strong desire to use it. And not a lot of time before it's pretty much a gone and done deal. So I'm going to go ahead and give myself some paint in the middle of this canvas. And what? And I'm going to grab an OXO omelet turning spatula. And I'm going to put that paint down. And prove, hopefully, <laughs> that anything is possible. Which is why I called my second book on the Amazon link under Show More Unlimited Possibilities. There is some black enamel in there. I do have edge catchers handy. I have also got all the colors that you just saw me put in there. Very readily available. I want a small edge catcher because the big ones flop into things. I'm going to let it go to my edges. You know what? I want one of these little cottage cheese lids. This is a hit and run. So I do, I want to tell you now, I sell my artwork. I give classes at the house in Spring Hill, Florida. I have Teespring clothing under the video where you can find all over print leggings and all over print t-shirts. Leftovers are a good thing. So if you've got them and you have a way to save them, you should do that because I'm going to prove it to you in a second that beautiful colors make beautiful art. And hopefully I'm right about that, but I'm pretty sure it's a safe bet at this point that these beautiful colors are going to treat me well and I can hope for the best. I'm just going to keep using my edge catcher until my edges are all covered. I'm going to keep squeezing that paint right over. And what else can I tell you guys? Underneath, uh, underneath the video, Pinterest, Instagram, and Twitter links and my paint pouring recipe, you can find them. Check your notifications to find out if they're turned on or turned off. If you share my videos, it helps me out. If you watch an entire video, it helps me out. Because that's the only thing that the YouTube algorithm responds to. There's something in there and I can see it and I want it out. But I am going to keep doing what I'm doing. I'm going to rock my canvas, my uh, edge catcher repeatedly until I get most of that paint off there. And then if I want some of it, let's see if, what that is. It's something that I should be trying to use my tweezers to get out. Come out, thing. Come out. Not cooperating. All right, so this is maybe not as exciting as I was hoping, but it doesn't matter because I can do stuff to it. Which includes dragging a skewer through and tipping again. I really like that turquoise in there. I'm inclined to play. I don't want to use any more edge catcher paint because it's pretty black. <laughs> Plain and simple. Um, what else do I want? I do love this though. And I could just keep doing that. Or I could mess it up. So it look more organic. But you can do that pretty easily. And I get to use some of the color I just mixed earlier. And see if I like it. And I could probably use a little more dark, some Prussian blue or something in there if I want to make it the color it used to be. That was the, um, the color shifting from uh, blue from folk art and then I add unicorn spit in the blue. Kind of want some more white in there but I like what I've got and I don't mind that one little spot is now covered and I can certainly 
pull an edge catcher over here and see if I can spread my colors out a little, which is what I kind of think I want to do. And there's something else that looks like it needs to go away. That one I can get. The edge catchers are all going to get cut up at some point in time. Or maybe not all of them, but a lot of them are going to get cut up and um, then I'm going to make collage out of them. Yes, I did. I just scraped my spatula with the black paint off on there because I wanted some more negative space. And I also wanted to see what would happen when I did that, and now I know. Now I'm going to do it again. And maybe on more, more than one side. I wonder if I can get that last bit over here. I love using up paint. I really, really do. And paint flows to paint, so it should push other paint around. And I could use my straw. I'm going to be kind of careful not to keep annihilating things I liked. But I can keep dripping onto my edge catcher. And I can keep taking that paint and putting it back in if I want to. I just want to make sure I get something I really like. And I love that negative space. Hopefully I'll like it as much tomorrow as I do today. There's a little spot of white I don't care about. I'm going to take my mess away such as, I, as much as I can and uh, look for another, yes, look for another lid. And I like that. And I'm going to torch. So it's a hit and run. Some great cells in there, little, even though they're small. There's GAC 800 by Golden in all of my paint mixtures, which means that I can leave a heavy layer without worrying. This is different. I like different. And making that paint smoke. I didn't waste my paint, which made me happy. I got some left over, but you know me, and I'll probably scrape it off into something else and use it again. So this is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard saying, check my Teespring under the video. That's my clothing with all over print t-shirts and leggings and more. Uh, if you watch the videos longer, you help me stay at YouTube because the algorithm only understands you watching longer. I really appreciate your thumbs up and your wonderful comments. And uh, I really appreciate the contributions that have kept me painting for almost a couple of years in April. And uh, if you want to join the monthly drawing, there are 15 paintings. Uh, at least there were last month. I'm not sure when this is going to when this is going to air, but um, so that whoever whoever's name is drawn is going to win three a choice of three instant birthday and Christmas presents. Um, thank you for subscribing. Uh, <laughs> check my channel for playlists of creative playlists. 1,200 videos. The first 10 are 100 in each. Then there's an 11th that's being populated. It may even be full by now. And uh, there's 13 genres there also. I kind of want to put some orange in there, but I'm not sure where. That's not orange anyway. There. That doesn't bother me. All right, I love you guys so much. Take care. I will see you anon. This is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard saying, I hope you could see all of that. And I remember the last time I had my camera zoomed this far out. And I needed to zoom it in. And I'll do that again. If I can. Hopefully without my head in the way. And maybe this won't dry too dark tomorrow, but who knows. We'll see you later. Um, binge watch, would you? And don't forget my Amazon link at no added cost to you. Helps me out when you shop there a lot. So I appreciate you guys. Thanks for being here. Hope I hope you come again. Bye for now. Priscilla out.